Yeah, as I said, linoleic acid is not a problem if it's coming from animals, sources. It's in the food matrix, not a problem. And all it will do is basically get incorporated into your cell membranes. And a lot of it will be converted because if you're not, if you're getting less, if you're not eating plants, that, that means you're not trying to force ALA and LA into being converted because one needs to be converted. The LA needs to be converted to basically arachidonic acid because that's the animal form that is needed. And that basically gets incorporated in the cell membranes and is used for a lot of these you know, anti-inflammatory and things like that. You know, bodybuilders actually um, supplement arachidonic acid specifically um, to improve their um, post-exercise recovery. So, exactly. So if you leave the pathway open, so you're not taking in plants which are competing to convert ALA to DHA, EPA, then you leave that pathway completely open to arachidonic acid. So you, this is why people, when they go on a low-carb diet or a carnivore diet, their arachidonic acid levels go up when they do tests. It's not accidental. And that's what you want, arachidonic acid, because arachidonic acid is basically the key um, uh, omega-6 that you need for healing and repair. That's why it's, it's the ancestral way. So don't worry about farmed eggs or whatever. God, I mean, you know, I say to people, if you can't afford, you know, these other ones, buy caged eggs. That's fine by me. I don't have a problem. Other people may, but I don't. You know, as long as you basically getting your, you're not putting in any plants, then you leave that pathway open to convert all the LA to, even if it's more, to arachidonic acid. Perfect. Not a problem. So, yeah, people need to stop worrying about these sort of things. They worry too much about nonsensical things. You know, ratios, plants. That's where this all, this whole thing about ratios comes from the plant world. People from the vegetarian and vegan world where they have these issues in the paleo world where they're eating too many plants. But once you step away from those sort of plant-centric diets, the issue goes away completely.